Hi viewers, remember this little number? Well, I quite often get some comments with people that haven't quite managed to get this running. So I thought I'd do a little bit of a tutorial. Right, I've actually got the uh, uh, hex from number seven, which I think is probably the default one, which is the uh, combined one loaded. And first thing, you want to do is if you just hold this you should get a, a default is every other LED lit both front side that's good uh, what I've noticed I get quite a few comments and emails uh, this is about as far as people go and I presume when it spins up it just produces this now uh, this is actually no problem and most of this is, is going to be good uh, what is either is is your sensor I don't know if you can see it in here the IR or the other sensor here is uh, probably connected wrong uh, I, I just disconnected that just to show you what it would be like is if it didn't work Obviously, if it did work, it would. I don't even know if you can see that. Probably not with the lights, but it, it is animating. A bit of flickery on the recorder, but it is animating fine by the naked eye. Uh, so, what you need to do is you've got to work out is it this sensor or this sensor? Well, there is a, a real simple way. I actually move it so this sensor's here I mean I think I did another video where you can look through a phone to see if this is glowing but another good thing because it's just pure infrared or IR I can actually switch it on so it's it's in its default I've, I'm stopping it rotating and then any signals from this if this actually starts to do things when I press a button uh, then this sensor is good uh, basically uh, every time this detects a signal of IR it thinks it's gone past this position so it then uh, starts to animate but something like a remote control will actually uh, just push a button as you see it is starting to animate or thinking it's animating so if your unit does this with a the remote then this sensor is good and you need to look at this sensor if it doesn't then you need to look at this uh, I believe there was some comments about yeah pick up now there are some comments about the uh, infrared receiver here being marked up wrong on the instructions uh, to be honest it's been a few months I can't remember uh, I actually changed this sensor for one that I bought with eBay and I think I bought a pack of 10 for about two quid and it worked as soon as I put it in other people have said they've changed turned it around and it's worked uh, but yeah if you follow those tips I said you can see if this one's slightly glowing with a mobile phone looking through the camera this one if you do the old trick here and it starts to animate that's working obviously if you're holding it still you do this the LEDs don't move then you definitely your fault is in here so I thought I'd just do this I do get quite a lot of emails saying oh the LEDs are either just walking which is I think the standard or this is number seven which as you can see every other one is lit all right that's just come off you can see it every time I go past this sense see the sensor here every time I go past it it will cause uh, the LEDs to flicker Okay, hope that was uh, useful in diagnosing any problems you're having with 
with this unit but it's great fun once it's going uh, and keep the emails coming in I, I do like to help a few people out and hopefully I have helped a few people out so many thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe